What's your name, babe? Laura. Laura, where you calling me from, Laura? You said Louisiana, right? Yes, ma'am. Louisiana. And how old are you again? 33. 33. What you do for a living, boo? Um, actually, I'm not working right now, but I'm a uh, entertainer. I do singing and dancing. You sing and you do it. How you pay your bills if you're not working? I have people that help me out. Who helps you out? Like some of my family members. I have to quit working to take care of my daddy. Oh, okay. Do you have any? We can't see your face, Laura, honey. And it's your phone's very blurry, sweetheart. I'm sorry. You can see me now. Um, you gotta pay attention, baby girl. Do you have, have any kids? No, ma'am. I'm trying to wipe my camera so you can see me better. Is that better? Yes. Do you have any kids? No, ma'am. Have you been here before? They're telling me you've been here before. Yeah, but my, my phone went dead. It didn't last long. Okay, so being that you're not working, do you feel like you're in a position to meet somebody? I mean, yeah, I'm gonna get a job eventually. I'm, I'm looking for one. I mean, it's not that I don't want to work. I'm just looking for one. You're looking for one. Okay, you said you have no kids? She's looking for a job. She's looking, no pun intended. She is looking. All right, so... <laughs> She could, uh, yeah. So we we could see how she may have a difficult time finding a job. You know, maybe difficult to see her way through some of these, um, some of these applications and stuff. And then y'all see the movie Sing that <laughs> hated movie Sing. My man, the little koalas attended the lizard with the. Never mind. But <laughs> but look, this is <laughs> he got no job. She got no job, and she appeared looking to date again. It was the same story last time. I'm, I remember. I remember. And she it. said she sing and dance for a living. We've been down this road. You see what? <laughs> y'all Have y'all not seen Sing, my man, Mr. Moon, the koala? They sing and dance, too. It's called Sing. And he got an attendant. It's a, it's, it's a lizard. And that y'all got to see it. I ain't going to say it. <laughs> This is wild. Poor sister. So she's been up here. She was just up here a, like a month or two ago. I, I, <laughs> uh. Yeah, there you go. As of right now, zero progress, Trey. <laughs> that's that's what we got. Keep it short. <laughs> zero progress. Thank you. Buddy. There we go. She had a standstill. She hasn't lost any ground. She hasn't moved forward or backwards. All right. So. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. <laughs> Claire. What's the um, zodiac sign? Scorpio. All right. Have you ever been married? No, ma'am. So we got Laura in Louisiana, 33, currently not working, but takes care of her dad. 33, Scorpio, no kids, never married. What kind of man are you looking for, honey? Uh, someone that's respectful, intelligent, smart, outgoing. Okay, what are your deal breakers? I don't like I don't like to be accused of anything. Um, um if you didn't see me do it or hear me say it, I didn't do it and I didn't say it. I hate being accused. Um I don't like disrespectful people. Um, that's about it. I mean I'm because very you easy didn't to hear get along. Me say it, don't accuse you of anything. So if you didn't hear her say it or do it, she didn't do it or say it. Yeah. Laura, what you got going on, honey? You keep moving, sweetheart. Because I'm trying to get into the light where you can see me. Who's behind you? That's my sister. She just walked in. Go ahead. Go out. I don't see what you're talking about. Okay. okay. So you're, all right. You don't be accused. Any other deal breakers? Ma'am. Any other deal breakers, Laura, honey? Ma'am, the guy look a certain way. No. What about money? Should he make a certain amount of money? No, as long as he have a job. As long as he have a job. Let's do the Kendrick. Wait, you don't have a job. Why he gotta have a job? 
I mean, if he got one, he got one. If he don't, he don't. We can struggle together. Oh, okay. Let's do the Kendra Cam. Can you see? We gotta see. Oh, we got. We, we got you. We got. We, we got Did you. Get you. Okay. Yeah, we got okay. you. Laura, when was your last relationship, sweetheart? Mm. About two, three months ago. Two, three months ago? Yeah. Okay. You don't have to answer, but I'm going to ask. When's the last time you was intimate with someone? A month ago. You so nasty. Is that guy an option? Is he an option? Yes. No. Why not? Um, we just different. Just two different people. All right. I would say who nastier, her or him? It's debatable. All right. And secondly, y'all, y'all see that mold on the ceiling? This is rough. She in the bathroom. The mold is. Y'all know what this is. Y'all know what this is. But I'm gonna tell you. What, listen, I'm gonna tell you what's for that gonna show. She qualifies for at least three piping hot bowls of butter soup at Mister Walker, Mister Gavin X's and Saint Asylum. That's what that gonna show. I ain't gonna keep playing with these sisters. If if these sisters are bold enough to come up here and say, look at you and look at me, and you figure out whether or not we compatible for dating, should that not apply to all of the sisterhood? Should y'all not send this sister the memo? She don't have a, a, a inkling of a job, all right? Then she don't, they don't know what they want. She just clashing meats. This is for not. I don't know who said in the chat, why is she here? You just clashed meats a month ago with somebody that ain't an option. Like I said, who nastier? It's 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 a flip of the dad going freaky coin. Who <laughs> they wicked? Here's the thing: like if he intoxicated, he ain't seeing that that I doing what it's doing. So I'm gonna say she nasty. <laughs> nah, nah, Nug Nug is not absolved from this. Nug Nug gotta eat that. If you lay down with her, you a wild <laughs> individual. Here's my thing: all these people talking about they sapiosexual. Like, I really want to know what kind of conversation do you have with an individual like this? Like, what's the com- what's the context of the of the conversation? What are they talking about? They ain't talking about, you know, stocks and bond. They talking about no, no, what no, you- no, 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 like, hey, I got some loud. Do you smoke? She like, yeah. You got a place? She like, yeah. And she like, you got a car? He like, not really. And then <laughs> somehow they make their way back to her place, though. <laughs> Somehow. Uh, oh, God dang it. Two different people. Okay. Um, what are three things you have to work on? Three flaws. I have to be more uh, uh, attentive. Um, I have to pay attention more to things. Uh, try to be more open. Okay. Uh, and try to listen a lot more because I have a habit of over talking people. Okay. And why would a guy be lucky to be with you? I'm very supportive. I'm not judgmental. Um, I mean, like I said, if I struggle, you struggle, we're going to struggle together, but we're going to come up together at the same time. I'm going to make sure that you straight before I make sure I'm straight. She's going to make sure you straight before you make sure she's straight because the guy have kids. Yeah. Do you want kids yourself? Yes. Okay. So we got Laura, Louisiana, 33 Scorpio, no kids, not currently working, but she takes care of her dad. Um, she doesn't care how you look. She doesn't care how much money you make. You can have a job, not have a job. She said we're going to struggle together. That that sounds like a recipe for disaster. Well, the time's out. <laughs> What's this? Hold up. Ah, she done tugged in my heartstrings. Hey, shout out to building together, i.e. struggle love is what today's modern hyena calls it. She said, we go struggle together. Sound like an old Jaheem song. Wait a minute. Huh? How many kids she got? She ain't got no kids, huh? She childless. Mm. Y'all too superficial. <laughs> Y'all too superficial. 
She ain't got no kids. She said she's going to build with you straight. She said she's going to make sure you straight before she's straight. I, I'm sorry I was listening here. This sister here, she's like a saint. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? So that's why last time we was at this very same moment at the crossroads and we decided to let her go. And it's, it's trending. It's trending. Yeah, man, she said it with her mouth. Here's the thing, though. With that being said, that was that was that was sweet, you know. And that's you know what? Listen, time out. That's what she's supposed to say. That self awareness. I'm sorry, this is the winning me over. Her self aware. She like I understand what's going on. She said I, I get it. She said so. I'm throwing it out there. I'm I, I'm gonna make sure you straight for I'm even straight. I please come help me. I'm gonna make sure you listen. Sacrificial lamb type ish. Hey. This is the yeah, catch and, and we say a lot of times, a lot of times in nature, you'll see things, right? Y'all might not like them, but they're good for the environment, like a praying mantis or something. I don't know. So, so yeah, yeah, wasps, hornets, they good, they keep down the fly population. A little do y'all know, all right, and they kill uh bugs that tend to feed on our gardens. So you may not like it, may be annoying, all right, <laughs> but need it. I'm here so, for this, sister. I'm a fan. All right. I dig your awareness. I think you deserve to get what you deserve. <laughs> so that being said, we're going to release her back to the public, folks. All right. Awesome. <laughs> woo -hoo. Put me in the water. Woo -hoo. Take me to the river. Woo -hoo. Like that shit for real. Huh? <laughs> You know, here in North Carolina, we like to respect wildlife. Backflip.